guy. Same thing. Now, we're going to take turns, so it doesn't matter who goes first. We'll let her decide. She may pick, you know, one pro to all do this at the same time. Good guy. We're going to take the sword and move the tip off to the right side. It's called yoy. It's doing two things. Number one is telling your partner that you're ready to do this. You know, so we don't have the ha ah, surprise move. You know, the changes my insurance. So number one, it lets your partner know you're ready. And number two, it lets both people know which way the attack's going. Because we have done cons where we go, all right, hunch me! And both people step forwards and stab each other. <laughs> Yay. Like it was a great fight. <laughs> From here, you're going to tip the sword to the side. Now, on each, she's going to step and stab from the center of my chest. Her goal was not to touch the front of the chest, but to go in one side and out the other. Okay, so make sure you move. Not having said that, good guy, don't die. <laughs> when she moves her center, you move yours. It's called my spacing. I'm just out of reach where she can't reach me without moving. So when she moves, I know I have to move. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to start here. We're going to yoy, and on each, she's going to step and stab. I'm going to step backwards and block from the right side to the left side. Samurai combat, it's called redundant safety. We're doing two things to make sure we're safe, and then we're going to kill them. So yoy, and then each, step and block. Now, the sword is on my left side, and my right foot is in front. That's the best thing I can do. On the third movement, I'm going to shuffle and bring the sword back up this way towards the neck. I know going really fast, you can block and stab, but she can duck and move, and they can, and you can miss. If you step back a block and bring the sword up this way, it's a lot harder for them to counter that. Okay, big 